Well, my friends, welcome back to a little game called Planet Crafter. You know, the game where we terraform Mars, and today we're probably going to be sending some rockets into space to collect lots of resources and get a really sweet map. So here we go. Oh, we're so close to liquid water, too. Rain, current stage, liquid water once the ground is saturated, and we have a beautiful rocket to create today. I just love crawling up on this thing and being like, man, we just climbed that elevator like it was an elevator, not a ladder. And there's our base. That's awesome. So here we go. We get to craft ourselves a launch platform. We already did that. Asteroid attraction rocket to give us global heat regeneration bonus and attracts uranium asteroids. This one is just iridium. We have plenty of iridium. So I think it's time to get the uranium. We just need a little cobalt, rocket engines, and super alloys. That's easy enough. Whee! Splat. Ow. I didn't know we could take falling damage. I'm guessing that once we get liquid water, this entire lake bed is just gonna go the way of the dinosaurs. And that's actually not. Dinosaurs didn't go, ex they went extinct. I don't even know what I'm saying right now. It's gonna fill up with water. Dinosaurs didn't do that. It doesn't make sense. But that probably means I need to get all the resources out of here because that's gonna go the way of the dinosaurs. Can I just like deconstruct things? Yeah. Oh, I wanna deconstruct you. Oh, nice! We just unlocked the bio lab too. We need to build one of those. And I'm pretty sure that's built out of this menu, isn't it? Where we can just get a new bio lab? Yeah! Biology and chemistry labs. Labs craft of bio recipes. Neat. That makes sense, because it's literally a bio lab. What do we have in here? Can I build. Ow! Need aluminum. Please be. Oh, great. Did I use up all my aluminum? I did. That sucks. Thankfully, I have an eggplant. I don't know why that's important, but I have an eggplant. So we'll just jetpack our way over to the aluminum area. I don't even know what to call this. And then hopefully there's some aluminum on the ground, which doesn't look like there's any. Oh, there's a little cave here though. And it has mysterious secret things inside of it. Nice. Oh yay, aluminum, space food. I don't really care about that. Just kidding, I'm gonna eat it anyway. Oh no, my gauge was already full. Can I go in here? I can. I don't know why I want to though. This is interesting. There's another entire wreckage back here. I don't know what it is, but I think I might need to build up something so I can survive back here. Just need a couple iron and a little bit of titanium. And this place looks a little weird. Oh, nice, we have one of these. Give me you, give me you, I need you. Solar panels, can I delete these? <gasps> Deconstruct solar panel, yes. Give me this. Ooh, storage crate. Another chip, beautiful. There's all sorts of wreckage here. Oh, and another solar panel, hot dang. I need that. Quickly, let's build a living compartment some, so I can live. Yeah, like that. And we're gonna slap a door on the front of it. Oh, like such as, go inside, breathe that air. Nice. Okay, I think everything's good here. I don't probably need as much cobalt, but we'll see what happens. I guess we can always just build a storage container and slap things inside of it that we don't really need too much of. And then go exploring some more. Give me you, I want you in my life. Deconstruct solar panels for free. Wow, this is like hardcore parkour. I like this. Give me that. What's in here? More lerma seeds. Sure. I was hoping for more of this stuff. Nope, that's ice. Can I just not? Why can't I deconstruct these aluminum things that are obviously aluminum? Ooh, another solar panel. Give me that. There's so much trash in those solar panels. I love it. Thankfully, we got enough aluminum to fill up our chest a little bit. We also got a few microchips. Come on. Ooh, a shredder machine. We can turn it into a Ninja Turtle nemesis now. And a GPS satellite. What? So excited. What's a GPS satellite do? Are you in here? And shredder. I want to know what shredder does. It's also a flower pot. Oh, if we poop in it, we can grow flowers. Nice. I should build some of these upstairs, but they're expensive because I don't have fabric. And I'm guessing the storage locker is just a better one of these. We could probably build one of those sometime too. There's the shredder. Wow, explosive powder. I need some of that. So if I remember right, we just need to make two of these super alloys to make the uranium rocket. Guessing I might need some iron and titanium. I don't know, cobalt, we needed cobalt for it. I just looked at it literally three minutes ago and I don't remember what it is anymore. Also, I can't jetpack up here. That's really annoying. All right, rocket. Ooh, okay, oh, I forgot we have to build a rocket engine, but what is this though? Provides geolocation to the mapping screen. Huh, I don't know if I care about that, but we can, we forgot a rocket engine. Oh, that looks so cool. What do you need, rocket engine? Oh, iridium rod and two uranium, which we don't have. Huh, I guess that means we're gonna go check out that other crash spaceship that we've not seen before. All right, this one looks pretty cool. I don't know how to get in here yet, but it looks like a big crash spaceship and it's amazing. There's also a lot of things over here. Interesting. Is this the way to get in? I believe it might be. Oh yeah, there's the, the what is it called? The cockpit? Ooh, oh wow. This is neat. 
Just want to deconstruct it all. I need to find the entrance. Are you the entrance? It looks like it. Oh, wow. Hello, lighting change. We're gonna quickly build up another living compartment here just to get the full oxygen and then throw in probably another regular chest. Yeah, just so I can store all the extra stuff that we're gonna deconstruct while we're in here. Thankfully, it's nighttime, so this shouldn't be too hard of a deal. And there's no monsters in this game, so I'm excited for that. Oh, is that a ladder to go down? It is. Okay, we're going down deeper into the ship. Ooh, nice. There's beds here. I want a bed in my regular base. Ooh, and there we go. We need this. Oh, we got seed packages too. Eggplant seeds, eggplant. I don't really need all that eggplant. There's beans. I'll take the beans because that's new and unique. Why is there just a bunch of eggplants laying around in the sleeping quarters? That's awkward and stuff. Oh, here we go. Big chest, big chest. Ooh, super alloy. Some more of that red stuff. I don't need the seeds anymore. Remember we've... Oh! Bioplastic nugget. Ooh, mushroom seeds. That was cool. Oh, wow. There's a straight up rocket engine. Nice. We had squash. You got your rocket engine right next to squash and eggplant seeds. What are you doing, game? You're so weird. What are these? Oh, lerma seeds. All right. What's in here? Yes, more iridium. What is that? Nola? I'll take that too. This has been a good little adventure in here. Oh, and another ladder. That one goes higher. I'm so scared to go up places. Okay, this must be where they had their seeds. Tusca seeds? I don't have ever heard of that. Oh, and another rocket engine. Beautiful. Uh-oh. Low oxygen. Um, um, I think I can make it out. I totally can make it. And now we'll just put some things back in here. Okay, back upstairs we go. Anything cool up here? Look around a little bit. Nope, gotta go in this way. Looks like another microchip box right over here. Got it. Take all those microchips. Another seed plant back there. Good, this is nice. Oh, wow, there's a lot of stuff here. Another one of these. Another one of those and these, and we don't care about the Lermas. That's fine. We know if we ever need seeds for anything, they're all over this boat. Okay, I made it back home with a lot of treasure. I like this one. We have a lot of cool things. I can also put all the extra seeds I have into this box. Good. Let's go back over and see what we can unlock with the microchips. An area lamp, that sounds stupid. Next one is the mapping screen. Okay, that's the one that was up on the GPS tower. We're also 70% of the way to liquid water, so that's awesome. Okay, back up to the rocket chamber, and I think I have enough for it now. Yes, the asteroid attraction rocket. Oh, oh, that looks so cool. I just, I just built a gigantic rocket. Come on, I need to get up so I can see it. Oh, that's so awesome. How do I launch it? I totally want to launch the rocket. It's got solar panels on it too. Maybe I shouldn't have jumped down. I just really wanted to look how cool it looked. Wait, do I press the big red button? I want to press space occupied. Okay, how do you how do you actually fly? Whoa, that was quick. I don't know how to fly a rocket. I've never done that in real life before. Is there like a rocket control module or something? Or you know, pressing that big red button does actually launch into space. So here we go. Oh, yes. Go, little rocket. Oh, it's taking off. I wish you could take me with me. We, we take you with me. Because I'm just alone here on this planet all by myself. Goodbye, rocket. I love you. Please, please send help. Also, there's like other floating things up there. Okay. Now that it's way up in space, what happens? I'm actually concerned now because the sky just went all dark. Oh, <laughs> did we just really summon in a meteor storm? Whoa! Don't hit this! Okay, that's kind of cool. If that has uranium in it, I'm gonna be so excited. Did that just land right here next to me? What? This is kind of cool. Oh, there is totally uranium because it's glowing green and junk. Oh, oxygen level low. No, not like this. Okay, I gotta breathe. I just really want to stare outside. Yeah, 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 yeah. Don't let all the- Oh, that crashed right into the side of the mountain. Oh, that was awesome. Oh, another one. Oh, that's cool. Oh, man. We're just meteors hit. Oh, that's coming right for me. Ah! Oh, food level critical. That just straight up almost murdered me. It almost murdered a man. Got it, uranium. Don't do that ever again, Mr. Mr. Meteor. I'm not spider, -er, like Superman. This is not my kryptonite. What do these big rocks do? Can I blow them up? Oh, yes, those big rocks might not go away. It's kind of funny. I like how the rocks are all glowing green and stuff. Well, the good news with all that uranium, I can build another uranium rod. And if I collect some water out of here, I should be able to create another nuclear reactor. 
Yay. Where do I put this one? Maybe just right back here? Sure. Oh, that's awesome. So much more power. So I can finally build some tier three heaters. Ooh, that's gonna heat the planet up so fast. I can build three of them. Yeah, let's just throw them in our upstairs because I forgot to use this place. Boop. That's awesome. And now look at how fast our heat is climbing. It's going like crazy. So the veggie tube does a T3. It does 13 oxygen per second, but the grass spreader does 108 oxygen per second. So we need a few more grass spreaders to get more oxygen into this planet so we can unlock the tier four heater. Thankfully, these things are fairly simple to build. So I should just be able to plop these down where we need them and start growing grass like crazy. Oh, I just got the achievement for liquid water. <gasps> yes. Okay, the lakes is the next stage. Where is the liquid water at? That's my real question. Does it accumulate down in here? No, there's no liquid water yet. Ooh, <laughs> but there's uranium. We wouldn't want uranium to stay down here because that's how you get Ninja Turtles. Now I had seen this before. Oh my, I didn't realize there's uranium down here, but it looks like I can maybe parkour around. There's also a box back on this side. Give me all that uranium, it's tasty. I like licking raw uranium pellets. Got that? Oh wow, there's even more here. I didn't realize all of that would be back here. I just saw that and I thought, maybe if I walk back here like an Egyptian, things might work well. Remember that song from like the 80s? Oh boy, things might not go well. I could be turned around entirely. But that's fine, going in caves is my specialty. Ooh, candy. There's a candy chest back here. Oh my, I like candy chests. My favorite vegetables. There's even a aluminum on the ground. Oh yeah, I totally knew there'd be something back here to explore. How do I get up on it though? Before I get up there, we gotta do our specialty. You know, the whole building compartment with doors and junk. Wait, how far does this world go? Come on, silicone, where are you? I need you for scientific purposes. Are you silicone? No. Are you silicone? Yes. I totally knew that was gonna be a parkour course. All right, living compartment, can I make it up in there? I can, good. I don't have any extra uh, iron, do I? Nope. Thankfully, there's some right here. Just getting some right here, got it. All right, that's totally aluminum. That's totally aluminum. Why can't I use it? I don't really know, but I'm going in. Probably a bad idea. Deconstruct Rex. Isn't that like a character off of Mass Effect? I don't really know what's in here, but I like it. Wow, there's a lot to be deconstructed. Let's deconstruct everything first. <gasps> I like this place. It's nice and bright and shiny because it's been destroyed from the outside. Why can't everything be destroyed so I can see better? Wow, there's a lot of stuff here. All right, canister, yoink, and this. Ooh, I need more Lermis seeds, not gonna lie. I need more of these too. I don't really need those seeds. Wow, there's so much stuff here. More Lermas, more aluminum, -num -num. more uranium. Wow, there's so much garbage. And by garbage, I mean totally beautiful things that I really need in my life. That's a big box. Here, you can have some of that and I'll trade you. Seems like a good trade to me. It's a bad deal when you have to get rid of water so you can get more uranium and aluminum. I guess we'll snack on a food too. Super alloy. Should I snack on a water? Yeah, so I can get aluminum. Oh, there's straight up super alloys on the ground. I just have so much stuff here. I don't even know what I need. I'm gonna drop that, take the aluminum, and then I can just trade it out. And we'll see what this little parkour trip is like. Is this all super alloys? It is. Hot dang. So much cool stuff here. Oh, there's a gold chest down there too. Oh, I fell. Ah, oh, poop nuggets. Well, at least I know where lots of good stuff is if I can figure out how to get out of here. Yay. I'm so excited every time I get to craft another uranium rod or just put in like 17 super alloys that we just found. Maybe I should craft another iridium rod, but I might need that ore. And let's see what else we get to unlock with the microchips. Jetpack version two. Oh wow, mining speed T4. I don't have one yet. I got, I have one, I don't have two. Maybe I should build two. Nah, it's kind of expensive, but I'll do it because I'm rich boy. And then I want number three. I just need a little bit of aluminum and we'll upgrade that mining speed even further. Very nice. Please don't tell me I need insomnium. I do, I still can't figure out how to get that though. So we'll just put that over here and I should be able to mine quicker. Also, I do have those two Lerma seeds. So let's craft up two more of these grass spreaders. We just need so much grass around here. Let's put another one right over here so our front door is nice and grassy. Now we still have way enough power production. All right, I need to go down and get that golden chest down here. So can I just, whoa, did it. What is that? A golden effigy. I don't know what that means, but I took it. Uranium rod, very nice. That sounds like a golden seed. Oxygen multiplier times six. 
beautiful. Actually, you know what? On second thought, I'm just taking everything so I can deconstruct it. Maybe I get some better loot. Aluminum is super alloy. I like that. I'll collect some of these super alloys up top just to make things easier. Oh, that'd be so nice if there's another gold chest back here somewhere. And I'm so scared walking across this. Can I jump across? I gotta see. Maybe I should just double check for any more super alloys over here. Anything more? Nope. So let's just jump. Oh, okay. That's a lot of super alloy if you ask me. Now the real question is where do all of these lead? Like there's a giant turkey leg over there. Is there another golden chest somewhere I didn't see? Or I wonder if I jump down over here. Oh, and then come across this one. Oh wow, I just clipped through the rock. Is there anything over here I can find? Not really. Okay, I better make it back home before I die of lack of air poisoning. So I wanna transplant one of these veggie tubes with that new golden seed I got, because that does six times the oxygen multiplier. Oh, I didn't even look. Some of these are really good. 300, 300, 200, we need these. That one's the worst. Get rid of you, we don't want you anymore. I'm gonna put these in instead. More oxygen is better than less oxygen. Also, I got a new rocket. I need to put this down somewhere, the golden effigy. Boop. Yeah, that looks kind of dumb. I like it. I have so many of these dumb things now. What do I do with it? I would like to make the bio lab, but that's still using the things I can't afford. Ooh, new blueprint, LG generator. That's fun. I was just trying to find these. Oh, pressure and heat. So if I keep calling in different asteroids, it should work better. Time for a magnetic field protection rocket. Oh, we got water. Oh, there's water down there. Dude, I'm gonna go splash in it. And splash. Splash. Hydration level low. I'm literally standing in the water. Hydration level is high, my dude. Can I just drink? It would probably be a good idea. I need to eat something, too. I'm gonna shove an entire squash in my mouth. And now it's raining. We have water. I'm so excited. We get to make algae really soon. Okay, here we go. Magnetic field protection rocket. Yes, it's beautiful. This one actually looks a little different. I like that. Good job, rocket man. Go to space. <laughs> Go rocket, go. Go rocket, go. Go rocket, go. I love it. Oh, that's so cool. And now we're just gonna get a space storm. That's probably a bad idea. I don't really care though. I want this thing too. Ooh, the pressure's going up a lot now. Okay, remember what I said about not wanting eggplants? We totally need that with the LG generator. Eggplant bioplastics. Eggplant bioplastic. Where do I get to plant this at? Maybe I could put it in here. Can I build it in here, please? Please build it in here. Kim's like, no, it has to be placed outside, you dumb idiot. Why would you even think about building an LG generator inside? <sighs> Maybe I don't. Where does it get to place? Hey, where do I place this at? In the water. That'd be a genius idea. Look at me being all smart and stuff. All I have to do is literally read where it says place on a water surface. Deal. It's working. We're gonna make like a blue-green LG slime pond, like what I have with the wastewater treatment plant near my house. Why does it always smell like raw sewage? I don't know. Is it because you have an LG generator going here? Is that changing things? No, just the skies making sadness happen. That one's coming directly for me. I wonder if I can catch it with my mouth open like you do in Snowflakes land. No, 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 fly away. Oh, that's, oh! Whoa, you hit my rocket terminal thingy-ma-bobber. Wow, what did I ever do to you, bro? I'm actually kind of scared. The entire world is shaking out there. Okay, I want to get the mapping screen here. I just need to build a compass, which I just built to check out. And then if I get the mapping screen with some iron, iron, plenty of it, I, lot, I want that mapping screen, okay? And I just place it on the floor. I need to build like a desk somewhere, but that works. Okay, show interface. No satellite in orbit. We need to send a satellite in orbit, which probably means I need to build another rocket, which is iridium rods and uranium ore. Thankfully, I have that stuff. So I can build another rocket engine. So I just need to come over here and click on the GPS satellite to construct my third rocket of the day. I always knew I would be smart and be a rocket engineer at one point in my life. Ooh, cool. And then press the button. Launch. Ah! Ah, I'm gonna blow it up. I'm gonna... It's got a case of the dumbs. Uh, it's like me playing Kerbal. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, there it goes. <laughs> Just like me playing Kerbal. Oh, don't you dare crash. <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. Oh, Jeb is going to be so mad. <laughs> Why do you have to be so dumb, Mr. Rock? Oh, no, 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 no. George is... <laughs> Wonder if it works.
Oh. <laughs> and it just disappeared. Okay, is it in orbit? That's, uh, that, whoa! Hot oh, dang, there's an actual map here. That, my friends, is how to get a rocket to orbit. And uh, that's the end of the episode, so hope you enjoyed it. Let me know if you did, and keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time. And I'd also like to thank the Patreon and YouTube supporters, especially Alan H, Apollo Bunny, Otto Dave, Beaninator, Ben, Dicky J, Teddy Hippias, Destructo Man, Eagle Lark, Maxer, Spencer T, VC Engineer, Whip It Good, Baron Fox, Zarnoff, Deegan, Jason M, Ral, Whiskey, Spider Sacks, Joe B, Fury Arrow, Doug Rules 2.0, Nerdy Geek, Skunk Chess, The Quarian, Link Hewitt, Bread, and Lewiski.